Hi guys, it's Serena Math Person. Today I'll be going over question 191 on SO exam P. So pause the video quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, assuming you already attended it, let's just dive right in. So the fire department, so they give you all this information and then finally they give you this. But the variance that we're actually trying to find is why is what is the probability what is the variance of y given as x is equal to 25? So that's exactly opposite of this information given here. So how do we figure it out? So we have to know that for a bivariate normal distribution, there is this variance formula, conditional variance formula, that says if the variance of x given y is equal to some y, then this is equal to theta x squared, 1 minus rho squared. And you can also say this for the same for y, given x is equal to some little x. This is equal to theta y squared, 1 minus rho squared. So if we know this information here, we can plug it in. So if variance of x given y is equal to 28.5, this is equal to, we know um, theta x squared is the same thing. If theta x is just um, standard deviation, then we know theta x squared is the variance of x. So it's saying variance of x, which we know is to be 76, 1 minus rho squared is equal to 57. Then we know that 1 minus rho squared is equal to 57 divided by 76. Then knowing that, we can actually just plug it into our second formula, the variance of y given x is equal to x is equal to um, standard deviation of, I mean the variance of y, which we know is to be 32, 1 minus rho squared, where rho squared is equal to this thing right here. 32 times 57 over 76. This is equal to 24, which is our answer B. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, as always, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye!